so the, uh, the computers you know department you know just started, and of course you know the, the computer become very much obsolete. So it, it really depends on what kind of things you learn. Okay, so the uh, the more basic uh, subject you learn, uh, the less change it has, and uh, um, the but the, the more basic you learn, uh, because it's uh, uh, it, it's pretty much constant. So uh, it is useful uh, in a much broader area. Okay, mathematics. You know, no matter how much world changes, mathematics is always useful, and it maybe even become more and more important. Okay, and whereas you know the computer. Uh, actually, I remember one thing very interesting. You know, I mean, when I was in the university uh, many years ago, I was asking my uh, father, you know, uh, maybe I should. Uh, uh, computer, you know, uh, becomes more and more fashionable. Maybe I should take uh, uh, take a computer course. So my father's uh, uh, response was, "Oh, computer course. I mean, it's just a manual for uh, the operating machines." Okay, which is uh, sort of like truth. I mean, the uh, computer changed so much, and uh, uh, the, the the kind of knowledge you had at that time, you know. It's probably completely obsolete, but the mathematics at that time, you know, is still the same, same as now. So the um, the the it is really the ability to learn new things. Okay, I mean, does that mean that I mean, the, does that mean that the, I'm a computer illiterate? I mean, okay, I, I agree that you know I I I I I I don't know how to do the programming and I don't know how to do any of these, but I have the learning ability. That learning ability is, you know, established by learning mathematics. So if I really want need to, you know, do the computer things, I think, you know, I mean, I can spend half a year concentrating on that, and I, I, I could be reasonably good, you know, at doing some programs. So uh, I should emphasize that, uh, um, you know, lots of things are different, uh, but uh, one should uh, pay more attention to the basic, unchanging things. Okay, and those things are actually more permanent and will be forever be useful in your whole life. Critical thinking is, uh, um, how do I define that? Uh, I more look at this as a practice, okay? I mean, the, um, uh, yeah, I mean, the way, Comes to this, uh, it has lots of things uh, comes coming to my mind. Um, okay, so basically, what you or, 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 or what I want to see, what I want to say is that uh, uh, I think the purpose of this, uh, maybe I should just say the purpose of this, is uh, uh, to go beyond the surface and uh, try to really go to the core of the problem. Anyhow, so the, you try to have a have a judgment based on you know the all kinds of uh, uh, comprehensive uh, kind of knowledge, and that requires uh, uh, actually that requires uh, uh, the material for the thinking, and that so that re it really requires you read a lot and then learn a lot, especially about the history and politics and philosophy and all these kind of things. So the um, uh, I really like the uh, the word of uh, 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 the Socrates, you know, the, the unexamined life is not worth living. Okay, the, you should really examine everything in your life. So the people should have that kind of attitude. You know, the, uh, I mean, the, the people should be rational, don't be everything is just emotional. And whatever you talk about, okay, you have to understand, you know, whatever you mean, okay, when you talk about democracy, What's your, your definition of democracy? Okay, do you understand you know where this idea coming from? Okay, I mean the, the I mean the, do you, I mean could it be possible that you know democracy can have a different meaning? I mean the, equally valid as you know your definition. I mean the the, the you if you if you just uh, you know the, the the talk about the things by using these kind of words freedom and democracy. Okay, I mean the, and without the much substance. Then it's not much better than uh, what I wrote during the Cultural Revolution. You know, the Dax bomb you know, during the Cultural Revolution. I was a primary school student. Maybe I was, well, was a ten-year-old kid. Okay, 
I was able to write a very good, uh, uh, you know, the uh, bomb, the peeling pico, okay, the, that kind of dance bomb. I was very good at, at that. Yeah, but does that make any sense or not? I was just basically uh, accumulating, you know, just building up all these uh, cap, you know, buzzword. That's all, all, all what, what I did. You know, I, I really didn't, don't understand. You know, I didn't understand any of the things I, I was writing. So uh, you know, you really need to make sure you really understand what you are writing. Okay? Otherwise, uh, be humble. Okay. So my opinion uh, is the, um, the how do I say this? Um, the certain amount of stress uh, is actually uh, necessary to bring out your abilities. Uh, one should uh, try to do the kind of things that are within your ability, but not too easy. So the, in the university, you, you, you develop your overall ability by you know, try to do all kinds of things. You know, uh, and uh, so, so uh, the, if you are able to uh, do the higher level or more difficult thing, uh, or, you, know, the, you should try to do that. I mean, that is your ability. If you, you only do the, you know, like the normal level or the lower level, uh, then the, uh, your, your, your ability is not fully developed. So the, uh, that could be a stressful thing, but uh, that also can be a joyful thing. I mean, the, if uh, you, can get, you get certain things easily, then you really don't appreciate that thing that much. And after you, know, uh, uh, you uh, make a great effort and you really understand uh, certain things, you really get it, actually it's a, there's a great satisfaction uh, you know, in, in achieving some certain things. Now, as for the stress, I mean, the, um, uh, this one has also has to do with, uh, uh, I mean, uh, the, having, having said that, you know, the, um, the stress uh, uh, it better to be worthwhile. Okay, so that means that uh, uh, you work very hard, but uh, you, you, you work very hard in the, in the, in the right way. Uh, so that, you know, especially for mathematics, that means that uh, um, you really uh, try to understand the concept of mathematics, okay? not just uh, you know, doing many, many uh, problems, but really uh, you know, understand the, the, the ideas. And uh, uh, that would, I mean, it, it is not so easy because it requires lots of thinking. But uh, uh, after you work hard, and you know, especially in the, you know, these more advanced courses, uh, actually, you uh, you will find that all the other things are easy. So that actually would be uh, very beneficial uh, if you uh, have have a relatively easier life in everything. Although you know you get the higher grade and you may get a very high honor to graduate, but uh, are you prepared for the you know, hard life outside? 